guys welcome to you all back to my channel today i'll be filming a get ready with me again but i feel like this one is so different because i'm using like a lot of different products and i just wanted to catch up with you guys because i haven't filmed a video in such a long time we're just gonna go right into it all right so i'm going to start off with a moisturizing cream so this one is from the ordinary it is really good you guys maybe as you can see my background is totally different from last few times I filmed on my channel and that's because I moved recently for the past two months I have been living on my own now and this is my little room I'm sharing this apartment with three other students I've been wanting to live on my own for such a long time you guys and I finally found this apartment it's like 15 minutes from the city so yeah it's just great I probably will be doing a room tour like in the future not completely satisfied with how my room looks right now so this part is really aesthetically pleasing um but i will be getting into a room tour once i'm completely satisfied because i'm probably going to be moving things around and i also have to clean my room because i haven't done that recently i have only one week of studying to go and then i'll be going to do my internship i'm really excited for it with that brand i'll be practicing graphic design within the clothing department so i'll be designing clothing items for women's collections and i'll also be making probably things like logos and the styles for websites and stuff so it's really versatile and i'm really excited to get started i by the way just used the ordinary it's just an oil and i'm going to go in with this primer these two products the oil and this primer i have used in my last get ready with me and then i recently got the moisturizer for my birthday for my dad i am really excited about these products i don't know but what else is different well my hair is different my hairdresser dyed it this week it's so different you guys i ordered a good purple shampoo so i can make this a little bit less warm toned but i'm vibing with the warm tone so i'm not going to use too much of it i'm going to use this hair oil and you just need like one drop i bought this in london over the summer but look how much i still have left and i like almost use this every day to keep my ends a little bit more healthy i have two foundations from ordinary and i'm going to mix that because this one is a high coverage and this one is a low coverage foundation and this one's a little bit lighter and this is for when i'm a little bit more tense so right now i'm in between them I also have new uh, brush tools, so these are from Boozy Brush and this brush is by the way the Stippling 1900 and I really find that this brush can really blend in my foundation so quick next I'm going in with the concealer from my cosmetics um, my birthday was recently and I turned 19 it's such a weird thing that I'm going to be 20 next year I'm going to be out of my teenage years oh but also um, I moved in and I found out that my roommate that sleeps on that side from my housemate his birthday is on the same day as mine so what are the odds of that happening? so I thought filming like another get ready with me it is like pretty much the same thing like I do always but the products I have been using have been changing a lot I've been trying to be like a little better for the environment and like not only buy things from brands that like don't care about animals and stuff so like ordinary is a brand that doesn't test on animals as well as a way when trying to get into that and I also have products from Glossier so that's also like a brand that's really good I'll be getting into that later apply the bird's bees a lip balm I'm going in with this palette from NYX Cosmetics so I'll be using this one in the corner I'll be bronzing my face with this and same thing goes here because this brush is so big it blends really well and so naturally this year 2020 i feel like this year is going to be such a good year here guys and also of course this month feels great because this is like my birthday month it's the capricorn month guys um but like i'm really into astrology and stuff or like the star signs i cannot just tell you guys i attract like in friendships or relationships or like everything i attract so much cancers and libras and i don't know what the thing is i really don't <laughs> somehow they just end up being my friend or um i end up like really liking this person and then later i find out that it's either of those star signs and i don't know how it happens but like apparently i tricked them we'll be talking about some favorites right now let's see i have some favorite music so of course i have still been loving Billie eilish she has been my absolute favorite artist for i think two years now in the meantime i'll be going in with this little brush from nyx cosmetics and using a color shade but like 
for the small areas. This is like an eyeshadow brush, but I only use like brown eyeshadow lately, so um, I can easily use this for contouring or bronzing up. Um, but yeah, Billie Eilish, I'm still really a fan. Like in the summer, I went to a festival in Belgium. Um, she was there. <laughs> I loved it so much, you guys. It was great seeing her live. Um, but also, I really have been loving Phoebe Bridgers. Like, Scott Street is like a really good song, so if you want to get into her music. Oh, Black Rose. Um, I followed him on Instagram, but he is like a small artist. His music is really good. It's really vibey, really laid back. I'm going in with some blush right now. It is from Kiko. So, I'll be using uh, the Angled Brush 2700. I'll be blending it in later with my foundation brush. So, next I'm going back in with this brush and then grabbing that same bronzer shade and then going to use it as an eyeshadow. So, I lately have been liking to track it apart like this. This MAC Cosmetics shadow. Blending it with the other eyeshadow. And then next I'll be doing my brows. So I have been using this Glossier Boy Brow for I think two weeks now and I'm really excited about this product. A friend of mine, you've seen her on my channel, her name is Jana. She went to London recently and there was this pop-up shop. This product is so easy you guys, it doesn't take any effort. But I'm really sad because Glossier doesn't ship to the Netherlands so if I run out of this can buy it again. Then I'll be using this precision brow pencil and the color espresso. With one line to define my brows a little bit. Look at this. It's almost empty. Um, I have another one waiting for me, so that's fine. But this one is the Becca Highlighter in C Pop. We're using this brush foundation 1400 brush, but I really like this for highlighter. Oh my god, look at this glow, you guys. I'm so obsessed. So I feel like putting a little bit of gold on my lid. I've been using this really small container. And then I'll be going with the mascara from Glossier. It's the Lash Slick one. I'm gonna use the Mary Blasco Skincare Facial Spray with aloe herbs and rose water. You guys are probably all familiar with this. I'll be using lipstick from Nars. I feel like it really fits the tone of my blush. Then I have this Halix. Um, this one is a fake. I don't have a, heel, a real Halix. Um, I'm just too scared to get it pierced. So I've been wearing this for like a year now. This fake, it hasn't fallen off. And then I always wear these chains. Um, these are from Tiger Lily and then I have these ones from H&M. This one is from Brandy Melville and it's like a little rose. This one I got from my grandma for my birthday. And then I have this little one in here from ASOS. I always wear my Capricorn ring and then I have this plain one. I'm really glad that I dyed my hair and this is so different right now because uh, I feel like a new person. And 2020 is just going to be such a great year. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. This was my everyday look for 2020. I love you guys soon, I'm back and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.